again. My grandma told me how Davao City was once a forestal area decades ago with limited number of dwellers before it developed into the city we now know. Along with the development of science and technology came the industrialization and urbanization of natural lands. Indeed, science and technology revolutionized the way we live our lives, making life conditions and daily tasks faster, better, and more convenient. However, they also bring disadvantages, especially in densely populated places like Davao City, as well as any other city around the world. The development of science and technology brings about air pollution, water pollution, and depletion of natural resources, among others. Air pollution comes as people, vehicles, and factories introduce excessive amounts of carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, nitric oxide, and methane into the atmosphere. Water pollution is the contamination of water bodies. This happens due to common water pollutants such as domestic waste, especially by squatters in coastal areas, industrial liquid wastes, insecticides and pesticides, and others. The depletion of natural resources is another negative impact of technology as demand for natural resources continue to rise. These mainly occur as a result of agriculture, mining, water usage, and consumption of fossil fuels, all of which have been enabled by advancements in technology. Aaron summarized human impacts into the following diagrams. Bulbulis and Bergman visualized in another diagram the interactions between humans and the environment. They believed that science and technology, despite being the cause of environmental degradation, plays an important role in protecting and preserving nature and addressing sustainability challenges. As time goes by, science and technology will infiltrate rural areas, natural lands, and these breathtaking tourist spots. But hopefully by this time, we can make use of science and technology wisely and utilize them in maintaining sustainability and in protecting and conserving the natural environment in which we live in. That's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching and bye-bye!